Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name's Inside A Gamer. Welcome back to Chef Life, a restaurant simulator, episode number two. I thoroughly enjoyed the first episode. I love these kind of cooking games and this kind of simulation game. Uh, so here we go. We're about to open our restaurant today, I think. Okay, I just installed the blackboard. Doesn't it look great? Uh, that's where we'll write down the dishes our customers can order. So what's on the menu for tonight? Uh, come find me in the storeroom oh, once you've decided. Okay, menu creation. Deciding on the menu. Choose dishes for the evening service from the blackboard. I love that. Your customers will order the dishes here. The daily special is more likely to be ordered. Okay, based on the dishes you select, your menu involves. It may start specializing in certain cuisines. As you level up, your dishes will become more sophisticated. Putting these more advanced dishes on the menu will raise the prestige of your restaurant. The dishes on the menu will determine the ingredients you need for the evening service. I love it. Is the first one the daily special or is all of it the daily special? I'm going to put that as my special. Uh, okay, so this is actually where we are going to put it all. I get that now. There is a new tutorial available in the storeroom. I just want to have a look at our research table. Currently unavailable. Okay, so clearly that's all it wanted me to do. Ah, got like a hot pass thing going on here now. Welcome to the storeroom. Uh, this is where you place orders for produce ingredients. Everything stays in the fridges here until we place them in the kitchen shelves. I'll let you take a look around. You don't forget to put in the order. We can't cook without ingredients. Okay, so this is our new kind of area, I suppose. And we do need to make a... What do you need for the daily service? The daily service. Okay. Each tile represents a different supplier. Look at what they offer and produce you want in your cup. Uh, you can check the ingredients for you need for the evening and the service here. Your needs will vary depending on what dishes are on the menu. Make sure you have all the produce that you need in the cart before placing your order. If over five units, we do get a discount. Price per unit for three. Now, these would be local at four. Ah, okay, so I see where we're getting at here. Well, you know what? We're a new place, so let's get some local produce, eh? Uh, so one, two, three, four. Uh, the meat, let's not go too crazy on price of meat. We'll get some stuff from here. We're definitely going to need about three. Two. Oh, hang on. And three of whatever these are. Okay, you have selected the produce needed for the evening. Uh, you can place your order once you have checked your invoice. From the invoice, you can check the details of the order. Note that your responsibility might be affected by the origin. Okay. And don't forget to place the order before leaving the market. I'll have your order soon. Great. The delivery's on the way. In the meantime, you can put the finishing touches to the dining room. Stock management. Okay, so clearly... I think it's a bit weird we need to move stuff from here to there, but hey ho. Enter design mode then. So go to design mode, one of your renovation stations inside your restaurant. Uh, you have two, one next to the storing door, another next to your office. The design mode can move each workstation, so you can also add new ones if you wish. Okay. I like that. Add a second cooking range to your kitchen. Okay, so I am in design mode. Where, where do I want it? That's the, the crazy question. Maybe here? Okay. And now we need to go decorate the restaurant. Can I do the same thing? Uh, I like how this has just changed all of a sudden. Decorate the dining room. Okay. Some decor theme like bistro or tutorial. Having multiple pieces of furniture with the same theme will create a certain mood for the room. Uh, you can also have access to the catalog of the kitchen and dining room. You use money earned during services to buy new items. Love it. Uh, 
age bar. There's your order. I don't know, I kind of like them. I kind of like both, to be honest with you. I kind of like the modern theme at the minute. Was that the only thing I was allowed to change? Oh, right, okay. Well, that was interestingly not. Okay, let's go talk to Max. Hey, here's your first area. I've already put everything in your fridges, so no need to worry about that. By the way, produce will drop in quality if you leave it in the storeroom too long, so watch out for that. Okay, so it's got stock management. That is pretty cool as well. I like that. It's a good good thing. They've also an expiration date. Keep in mind because you want to serve fresh dishes to your customers. Oh, and I got Kasim's message. Thanks for the invite. I'll see you soon. I wonder will she get all dolled up. Right, so that's done, right? So what do I need to do? Pick up the crate. Okay, I see. Load the crate with groceries from the dairy produce. Oh, uh, where was the dairy? Here it is. Well, we haven't ordered very much, so... Where's this going, then? Oh, can I fill up this basket more? I see. That's kind of cool. So you can keep stocked up. Don't have to do all the ordering all the time. It is pretty smart, actually. Right, on fridge. And you can put them in the freezer, if you wish, as well, to make them last longer. But who wants frozen food? Jesus. Okay, do you remember what our cooking instructor used to say? Always preparing in advance is the key to success. With new deliveries, you can start prepping for this evening practice service. Max and I will act like regular customers, uh, so make sure you prepared some things in advance, just like any other day. This is something that we can do. I can only do three at a time, so uh, let's get shallots chopped. Let's get my potato chopped. So I got some fries, and let's get our tomato chopped as well. Uh, we need to cut mozzarella, which I think is in here, right? Um, I need the fl uh, no, sugar. We want the flour. And I need the fish. Make sure we slice our mozzarella. We can flower our soul here. Store slice mozzarella in the refrigerator. Okay, so they're literally just going back where they are. In the kitchen fridge. Is it this one? Okay, because this wasn't here before. Ah, but it's so cool that we can pre-prep now. Cook green beans on the cooking range. That makes service easier, wouldn't it?
suppose you want the water up to temperature first. That's how I know to cook green beans. All green vegetables. Flash boil. You know, a couple of seconds really. Into ice water. A little bit different here, obviously. It does need salt. I don't have any seasoning on me. I kind of wish it would just stay on me. Just a little bit of salt. Not enough salt. Perfecto! So we'll get these hard boiling. So the green beans in this dish must just be uh Pick up the green beans cooked green beans. Place the pot on the warmer. Oh. That's not how I would have green beans sitting, but look, fair enough. Whatever. I suppose it keeps them warm, doesn't it? Okay, you're doing great. We'll be able to have Max come in for service. Uh, you can go into the kitchen. I'll welcome her and take her order. One day before that grand opening. Customers' orders are usually taken by your servers, uh, but this is only a practice service. Kasim and Max will give you their orders directly. Once the tables have made their choice, the orders are shown up on the top of your screen. You can help your recipes for all your dishes on the menu. You are automatically pinned when the service begins. Don't forget, you can still use the food you previously stored on the warmer and in the refrigerator. Of course. An order has arrived. Table has placed an order. Try and serve the dishes as fast as possible. A table left waiting too long, become impatient, and you'll lose points for the service. And on the other hand, you earn extra points for serving the table quickly. Take that soul out for a second. Uh, I need that molasses stuff. Right. Let's get our cookware. I need a pot. Obviously, I don't want to get that stuck, and let's get another pan. Give it one quick stir, because I have to think about it. Uh, I need the olive oil. And butter. doing its thing. Might not be the most perfect, but uh, it will do. I 
How do I get the green beans out? Okay, so they want a medium steak. Oh, you gotta plate them up at the back. Oh no, I forgot. Stupid mixing table. Basil now. Uh, I've messed this up, haven't I? I'm so proud of myself. I'm cold now. I don't think that's a good thing. Uh. Why did I not serve it? Steak and bloody chips now. Jesus. Okay, we need a frying pan. Take this. I don't have any seasoning again. Okay, we perfected that one. I think the slots didn't go in till like nearly near the end of this one. Okay, in the meantime. I forgot to flip. Keep on the warmer. That's what we probably need to do, isn't it?
It was a good service. New customers plus regulars. We earned, uh, earned a little bit of dollars. Hey, and we're up to uh, level two, I suppose. Nice restaurant, worth a look. I thought the menu was a little uninspired uh, tonight, but your dish of the day proved me wrong. Yeah, wasn't great. I think my green beans were... I think it was too cold. Yeah, food was cold. Uh, thanks for the meal. It was a simple food, but it really hit the spot. You have clients lining up around the block for sure. Uh, for a practice service, it went really well. It gives me a lot of confidence in the grand opening. Now that our guest has gone, it's time to clean up the kitchen. Uh, I still have a couple of things to take care of before we open, so I'll leave you to it. Well, tomorrow's a big day. I'll meet you here at moon and noon, moon, moon, noon. Get some rest in the meantime. Good night. Do I not clean up my own crap then? We can literally just go to the next day. So realistically, if I can put green beans in the warmer, I should be able to make this sauce in advance and stuff as well. I don't think that sauce needs to be served hot. Shall I check? Nothing is available. Okay, go to the next day. Okay, the work day. The grand opening restaurant has finally arrived. The work day starts early in the morning and ends after evening service. You can keep track of time on the clock at the top of the screen. Start with deciding today's menu, then stock the kitchen shelves and ingredients you need. Once the shelves are stocked, start prepping for some recipes in advance for the evening service. Your chef's usually around midday. Kasim should arrive around to start the work day. The service will arrive later tonight, just before service. You should have enough time today to take care of your restaurant. In the spare time, use the design mode, plating editor, and learn new recipes. Okay, customize the in-game experience. Recipe recipe details, certain dishes are displayed as you cook. Your dishes will not fail or burn. Uh Yeah, I mean we want to challenge. Oh no, hang on. Turn off. I'm not too worried about the amount of customers, but you know what? We'll keep a calm service on. Alright, well, we know what the menu is for today. We're going to have our minimum of three items. We're going to keep it easy. Do I still not have stuff from yesterday, then? Is that how this is working? It empties out. What are you going to cook today? Okay, so... Why don't we get our meat? Local and fish. And then uh, we'll go to the supermarket to get the vegetables. And the other things, because we will get a discount. Consider it done. Okay. Not much I can do there for a minute, so shall we have a look at the recipe book? Uh, research table, I mean. I can't unlock anything new yet. Orange, carrot, and mint consomme. Well, that could be served cold, so that won't be too bad. But I need to be level three, so even though I've got the knowledge points, it can't happen yet. Which is fair enough. We're just waiting for the delivery then. What more, what more can we do? Look at this beautiful kitchen. My chef seems so happy. Does she come in every time? I think she wants my number, really. Hang on, she already gave me her number. Hey, chef. Just leaving your delivery here.
Ah, so they're in here now. How am I missing an item? Clearly I did not order enough then. Now. What do you need? I do the rounds of the suppliers and then deliver to you. Yes, I've made a bit of a banana there, haven't I? What can we do in here? I think in here looks alright. Nice little cozy restaurant, really. If the stocks disappear every day, I feel like that won't be as good because it won't really matter about rotation as much. I suppose we could just fill up here more but if we have, if we got plenty of money. Maybe that is something uh, we could have probably done. Okay, we're all filled up. So we can actually get some things here. Well, not only stuff I can prep. Okay, they want us to go into the office. Interesting. Obviously, we could hire staff and stuff in here, right? Welcome to the management panel of your restaurant. You're on the restaurant page. Each page, okay. Uh, the team page, you can check the state of mind of your chefs. Dashboard city, previous services. Uh, display important information about your restaurant. You can also change the name logo of your restaurant here. Your clientele is uh, represented by the gauge. Okay. Hygiene gauge shows the hygiene level of your restaurant. Be sure to keep an eye on it and assign a member of your team to cleaning duties when needed. Okay, dokie. So, what is the emblem? Is that all day long? Now, name of the restaurant, guys, I'm leaving up to you. Tell me what you would like me to name. Leave it in the comments down below, and I'll pick the best one, and we'll call it on the next one. Uh, okay. My team. He'll be here at noon. Hmm. That's fine. Right. We do have a catalog. Okay, so we can buy new things. Uh, look like meat grinders and stuff. How cool is all this stuff? More chopping boards. Dining room can get stuff. Structures so we can make the floors better. Characters that we're going to unlock loads of new stuff. New plates. This is how we get our plate in. Uh, they're not cheap. 
I like it. My office chair. You can relax in your chair to make time pass faster. If someone wants to talk to you and an important event occurs, message will be interrupted. Well, this is it. Tonight's showtime. We've been working for months and finally opening. Now that everything is ready, I can take my place as chef in the kitchen, which means you can assign tasks to me. Okay, signing a task. Talk to one of your chefs to assign them to tasks. Kasim can only be assigned to clean the restaurant. What? Note that higher responsibility levels, higher your team spirits. Okay. Asking a chef to clean the restaurant will increase the hygiene level as shown on the dashboard. Uh, during a hygiene emergency, you must ask one of your chefs to clean the restaurant to prevent your clean restaurant from getting even lower. Dealing with hygiene emergency takes time, so consider cleaning your restaurant regularly. No problem. If he cannot do anything else. Hey! Come here. Oh, he's cleaning the restaurant as we speak. Okay, so I want to take the flour. And we're going to take some fish. We're going to get you all chopped up, my friend. Just like that beautiful uh, soul fillet. And then we're going to go to our mixing station here. Let's get you all floured up. Uh, we can place you in the fridge. Now, green beans in the pot, pot, pot. Let's get our cookware. I'm so glad he can at least do something. So we do actually have some more stuff. Uh, okay. Let's I get... saw your last dish. It was great. You just keep improving every day. Yes, Kasim. Okay, let's get the salt. Uh, let's get this powered on. Get a bit of salt in there. Okay, that's perfect. We can leave them boiling. So why don't we... We've got two potatoes there. Let's chop them up quickly. So, like, if we did prep, you know, it should stay. No idea if I'm going to need two fries. Hopefully, it can fit in here. Oh, there's three fries in there now. So, can I cut meat as well? Thanks for your advice the other day. It was really helpful. All right, this is nearly there. All right, let's see. Can we do that then? Now we've got no mozzarella cut. Thing is, who knows how busy we're going to be. I only had two customers yesterday and they put me in the crap, didn't they? I think two would be okay. I don't know, can I actually fully plate them or not? What you tell me? No more space. Let's see if I can get another shot in there. I mean, it's not expensive if it goes wrong.
I mean, we might sell quite a few steaks tonight. No more space. Okay, I get you now. I see what you have done. Malami. Okay, so... Yeah, we can't do much until probably this service, really, can we? Let me know if you need a hand. He's actually cleaning. Okay, let's get a frying pan out. So I'm not messing around later. Let's get another frying pan. Let's get a... I'm not sure can I actually make this sauce beforehand or not. Maybe I should check. Does the balsamic cream need to be hot? Hmm. I've got nowhere to store it now, though. I think we'll be okay. We're not going to be that busy tonight, let's be honest. Let's go sit in our chair. Let's fast forward. Eventually, we'll be able to get staff as well, which is great. Hello, chef. Do you have a minute? Okay. Who are you? Uh, is this the new restaurant? I just came to welcome you to the beautiful city. I'll try to come eat here in the next few days. I can't wait to see what you have on the menu. You wake me up for that. How dare you? Very late service. Service should really start about 5, 6, no? Maybe 7 o'clock service. 6 o'clock. Hey, I decided to hire a head server to manage the serving staff. I help out today so he can get up and running quickly. And here she is. Okay, Parry. Hey, Chef Parry. Nice to meet you. I'll take care of everything in the dining room. I manage the servers and custom service. So you can focus on the kitchen. You only need the kitchen. Speaking of customers, they'll start arriving soon. So go get ready. Okay, you have met Parry, the restaurant's head server and experienced server. She is excited about her new role and manages her team with enthusiasm. The temptation to cook some fish is very tempting. Now, will they stay on? I feel like they should. Oh, we do have a new member of staff over here. What the hell? How am I affording all these people? I learned a little technique for this job. You know what? Good on you. We've got some in the fridge, but I can keep some on me, so let's do that. I don't have a load of slots, but I've got the basil, so I don't forget the basil. station okay we are technically open for service uh, my beans okay I actually have to go open this restaurant myself. I mean, I've got enough of these guys, no? That's it, everything's ready. Time to open the doors. Can't believe we're actually opening our own restaurant just like we dreamed in culinary school. I know what it takes to become one of the best restaurants around. We can do it. Love that we've got like this little bar now. Customers are arriving. Yes, uh, we're going to be in crap. Is he here to help me or what? I don't even know where he is.
Oh, it took away all my things. You sod. Okay, well, what I want is definitely some basil on me. Okay, so I'm not allowed in there. Where is he? Uh, anyways, we got an order. A new order, chef. Okay, steak and chips, of course. Let's get these bad boys on. Let's get a. Let's just use what we got in the fridge, really, aren't we? Okay, give me that. That. A mozzarella, a tomato, and you. Even my frying pans have come back out. <laughs> Alright, that's fine for a minute. Let's get these chips on. Oh, I don't have the other bloody thing, do I? I need the pot. Okay, let's get these bad boys added. Okay, we'll flip it. Okay, wouldn't let me take my chips. I'll make that stupid sauce. Freaking hell. Right, well, we're nearly ready. We'll give it a quick start. That's all we're kind of waiting on for now. I mean, it is a big thing, like, can I just wait for that? Oh, I got. Okay, plating station. Get the hot thing out first. Man, how cool am I? Uh, serve the dish.
That smells so good, chef. Ooh. A British accent on him. Sure, lemon soul's gonna be brought here now. Them green beans aren't gonna last much longer. I mean, it's as obvious as hell this is what's gonna happen. I mean, we, we saw that coming from a mile away. Man, it's so annoying that I've only got these two. Maybe I need to rearrange this kitchen a bit better. The butter would go more near the end, though. I could be very wrong here. Don't really know how many green beans I need. Probably just one. And another service done. Hey, I'll never get tired of it. Hey, we got some tips as well. And we're now level three. Today's special uh, should be everyday special. They clearly like the steak. I mean, they didn't find any issues with the way I cooked it.
Still, there must be a way now to use a bin, though. Responsibility down? Why did that give me less responsibility? Do I get more responsibility if I clean up after myself? Is it worthwhile? It does not make a bloody difference. We will have a new recipe on for tomorrow. So that's something at least. Uh, we could probably unlock it now. So we have unlocked uh, one new thing from Casual, uh, which is uh, Orange Carrot Mint Consomme. There you go. So we've got some new ingredients for the shelves. Uh, new cookware included. They are now available on respective shelves. Can I do that? No, we can only do that in the morning. Obviously, that looks like it needs something for that. Okay, guys. So, look, I'm going to leave it there for this one. It's quite a long one again. Let me know. Do we carry on or not? Restaurant open. Do you want to see more of this? Let me know in the comments down below. Uh, subscribe if you're new. Come join us in Discord. And other than that, thanks for watching, and I'll see you at the next one. Bye for now.